Hey guys, quick video today. I got the sawmill out here and we're gonna cut up a bunch of these old logs. I uh, took these from a construction site last year or something. There was a free ad in Craigslist for logs and I mean there was like 10 semi loads of logs and that's where pretty much all of my lumber has come from was just that free ad. So we're gonna get the rest of these cut up and uh, you can see I have some here. This is uh, all three quarter inch and it does have some holes in them from the grubs just sitting on the ground but that's okay we'll call it ventilation for the barn um yeah we'll get to it okay so to be a little more efficient um i only need about 120 inches of board and this is this is 125 here so i'm going to cut right here and uh just get rid of the excess so i'm not milling more it's taking more time uh it's dulling my blade more so i'm going to cut that off real quick and uh, then just mill what I need. If everything's the same length when you stack it, it stacks better. You don't have to sort the sizes. It looks nicer. Everything works better. Okay, I think we're ready to mill.
All right, we got these two special pieces here. This allow us to cut within one inch of the bed. So what we do, they just slip on over. Now make sure all your back stops are down because I have tried cutting through it. As you see, it doesn't work. This right here just grips the edge. And if you don't have a good clean edge like that, you can just rotate your beam until you find one. These beams are small enough to handle just uh, with your hands. You don't need a cant hook or anything, which is nice. So even though I'm cutting three quarter inch boards, the last board will be one inch. Because that's the lowest I can go. All right, so on my scale here, it's showing the last board is just over an inch and a half. So I'm not even gonna cut it. I'll just leave it because I don't need a one inch board right now and I don't need a half inch board. So I can use this kind of like as a, you know, two by six or something like that. That'd be good. I'll throw it off to the side for now. If you have any questions or comments about uh, how I do things or if you have any tips, I'm definitely not a pro but I enjoy doing it. So uh, send me a message, give me a thumbs up, likes. Well, thanks for watching guys.